The following paranormal YouTube videos stand out from the usual fakes and jump scares. Take a look at these videos and tell me which ones strike you as legit. Number 14. A YouTuber named Sean Wells 2001 is convinced that something unholy is lurking in his attic late at night. It always starts with a weird static sound, almost like an industrial fan, even though nothing is plugged in. Sean leaves the camera on overnight to see what happens. The mechanical humming sound doesn't go away, and then at 3 a.m., new disturbances are heard. And if you are wondering why Sean doesn't go up there and see what it is for himself, here's why. There's no way a raccoon or any other creature would have enough strength or intelligence to lift up the attic door like that. So Sean's video is either 100% paranormal or just a prank. Let me know which one you think it is, because I really can't tell for sure. Number 13. Pasty Pickle is the name of a YouTuber who has been having a strange house problem. Time and time again, he goes outside only to see a figure in the window. Despite there being no one in the room, there seems to be no rhyme or reason as to why this happens. Sometimes it does, and sometimes it doesn't. He shows that no one is hiding in the room, and then goes outside to see if he can capture the elusive figure on camera. Holy sh**, there's actually a figure today. I actually got it on tape, no way. The sun kind of gets in the way, but look closely at the top window and you'll see a very faint outline in the center. It almost looks gray and formless. You can see it a lot better here. Wow. Holy. <laughs> okay, all right. Give me your best guess as to what you think this could be, paranormal or otherwise. Number 12. A paranormal investigator who goes by Bakersfield Paranormal Services sadly lost his mother and is filled with grief. Even though he is very distraught, he wants to communicate with her. He goes to the cemetery with his equipment and approaches his mother's marker. At first, he asks some basic questions and has her respond by playing with the lights. Are you always around me and my, my wife and my kids? Thank you. Emotions there, Mom. Do you love my wife? Okay, I got it. I, I got it. After a while, he pulls out what he calls a ghost box, which supposedly allows his mother to communicate using various radio frequencies. He believes other spirits are crowding around the box and keeping his mom from communicating. Mom, can you please speak to me? You're trying to? He thinks she says, I'm trying to, but I think it kind of sounds like she might be saying, I love you. Listen to it again, and let me know what you hear during this part. Number 11. Marcus Webb has been feeling a presence in his house and decides to start recording. A white specter passing by is what he claims to find. I'm not sure if this is a dusty cobweb or something truly paranormal. All I know is that Marcus felt like he was not alone and the camera verified that something moved nearby, which is definitely a creepy coincidence. Number 10. A YouTuber named Lee Boggs is hanging out in his attic because they heard some noises earlier that they believe were paranormal. Now they are trying to instigate the ghost into revealing itself. Lee doesn't have to say very much before the ghost takes the bait. Stop hiding and show yourself. Give us a sign. 
What the hell was that? Did you see something? We just got something on video. What was it? Well, this could just be a speck of dust. The timing is too much of a coincidence to deny. Let me know if you believe Lee Boggs captured something on tape, or if you think they've been spending too much time in the attic. Number 9. A man at work accidentally locks himself in a large attic. He's trying to open the door when he hears a strange noise and decides to start recording. He thinks out loud that it could be a rat or a pipe as he cautiously continues to film. I'm getting kind of a spooky vibe up here. Right there. There it is again. Soon he realizes that the strange thump is coming from the very top of some steps that he has never seen before. He climbs the steps and suddenly feels like he is no longer alone. Hello? Apparently he was right. Whoa! Something clatters to the ground and sends him running down the steps. I'm not sure how he managed to get out, but when he did, I'm sure he was glad he had plenty of video evidence to back up his claims. Number 8. A YouTuber named Ariane Childress is a ghost hunter, using some sort of paranormal software that I'm not familiar with. It almost looks like split screen night vision, with some sort of enhancement feature on the right. Anyway, Ariane uses the program to capture what appears to be an oversized face, lingering in her window. And seriously, I'm like looking at this window, there's nothing out there. <laughs> it looks like there's a face. That's really creepy. She says that she's been feeling watched in real life when she turned the app on and pointed it towards the window. Meanwhile, the colors continue to switch from pitch black to a gray discolored face. Not normal. Be sure to let me know what this app is and how it works if you have any knowledge. Number 7. A YouTuber named Joseph Chan Sloam has been experiencing paranormal happenings around his house for quite some time now. Most of the activity happens around his bedroom, though no part of the house seems off limits. After giving a brief tour of his house, Joseph turns out most of the lights and goes to bed with the camera running. He wants to catch the ghost in action. It isn't long before everything he was afraid of starts to happen. Joseph wakes up and grabs the camera. He races around the house trying to find an intruder, but comes up with nothing. Let me know if you think this is real, and if not, how he did this all by himself. Number 6. A YouTuber named the Ghost Metalhead 666 is filming an empty room in the castle of King Henry VIII when suddenly a visitor materializes before his very eyes. Look in the bottom left corner to see it. The YouTuber captures the translucent outline of a small child. You can see how the toddler starts out on the floor and unsteadily climbs to its feet. The head, arms, and legs are unmistakably human-like. If someone is any good with video editing, then let me know if this is fake or the real thing. Otherwise, as more than one person pointed out in the comments section, Henry VIII did have many stillborns during his reign as king, and this perhaps could be one of them. Number 5. Explore With Us is a YouTube channel that goes to abandoned areas to see what they can find. This was taken during their very first live stream when they were checking out a post office and a general store in the middle of an old ghost town. The rickety buildings look ready to collapse at any moment, but what's inside the buildings is not the strangest part of this video. About three and a half minutes into the stream, someone tries to make contact with the group. 
Should I answer that? Hello? Hello? No one is on the other side. All they hear is this strange noise. Obviously, this could just be a prank from one of the viewers, but I don't think their location was ever disclosed. Therefore, it could have just as easily been an old resident of this abandoned town. There's just no way to tell for sure. Also, pay attention and you'll see a faint red light in the distance. Hopefully, it was just a cell phone tower or something like that. But then again, there doesn't seem to be any other structures nearby, just darkness. Number 4. This one's a little difficult to see, but when you do, the payoff is worth it. A YouTuber named Past is exploring an abandoned property in Nottingham. Pay attention to the very last window during this clip, even then, I doubt you'll see it. Now here it is again, with the paranormal sighting highlighted. Something very large appears to move quickly in the very last window, however this window leads outside and is two floors from the ground. With this in mind, what could this moving object be? Number 3. Now, this ladder is walking down the driveway. No one's touching it, no one's around it, and it's actually walking down the driveway. That's the reaction of Tony Dode as he videotapes a walking ladder on its own. The ladder clatters down the driveway as if someone is guiding it in short steps, but nobody is near. If you have any possible explanations for this, or have seen this before with your own eyes, then please share your experience. If no one has a proper explanation, then this is one of the most perplexing videos I think I've analyzed on this channel to date. Number 2. Drew2727 is watching a boxing match with some friends when he catches an unwanted visitor outside. Pay attention to the sliding glass window as he pans around. An impossibly large creature with a long twisted neck appears to be regarding the group from the backyard. I will say that something does feel a little staged about this video because no one is talking or even looking at the camera as it passes by, but I guess it could have just been a quiet group of friends. Before we get to number 1, my name is Chills and I hope you're enjoying my narration. If you're curious about what I look like in real life, then go to my Instagram at DylanIsChillinYT and tap that follow button to find out. I'm currently doing a super poll on my Instagram. If you believe ghosts are real, then go to my most recent photo and tap the like button. If you don't, DM me saying why. When you're done, come right back to this video to find out the number one entry. Chills merch is now available and I'm gifting viewers who spend over $100 with a 100% free foot lettuce t-shirt to show my appreciation. This offer won't last forever, so get yours by visiting chillsmerch.com. Also, follow me on Twitter at YT underscore chills because that's where I post video updates. It's a proven fact that generosity makes you a happier person, so if you're generous enough to hit that subscribe button and the bell beside it, then thank you. This way, you'll be notified of the new video I upload every Thursday. Number 1. A YouTuber named Dylan HD decides to explore an abandoned house with some friends. The home still has some furnishings, including a wall full of creepy paintings of children. The far end of the house is completely dark, and they are hesitant to explore this section. Finally, one of them bravely goes into the darkened corner and comes back shaken. He announces someone is looking at them through the window. Pay attention to the thin beam of light behind him during this clip, because that's the window he's referring to. So someone was at the window. Act. Someone was at the window. Was. It's gone really bright now. 
Is the window off, though? No, it's... it's the same... Oh! The thin beam of light silently extinguishes as the window is closed by whoever was on the other side. It's important to note that all three friends were close together when this happened. One could be seen on tape, the second was holding the camera, and the third could be heard directly to their right. The trio runs screaming out of the house and never looks back. The East African country of Somalia once had a strong fishing industry protected by a powerful coast guard, but when civil war dissolved the country's naval force in the early 90s, the entire fishing industry collapsed with it, and the once peaceful fishermen had to become pirates to survive. 